Okay, here we have finding the time in a word problem on compound interest. So for compound interest, it's a different formula. It's A equals P1 plus R over N to the NT, where N equals the number of times compounded in one year. Okay, so it says Ahmad deposited 5000 into an account with a 9.4% annual interest rate compounded quarterly. Quarterly means every fourth of a year. So that means that it's compounded four times a year. Um, the rate is actually going to be um, 0.9, or no, I'm sorry, 0.094. And then the amount that I deposit, so that's going to be my present value, what I put in at the beginning, right? Um, assuming no withdrawals are made, how long will it take for the investment to grow to this? So this is the amount after some time. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to plug all of these values into the formula where they belong. So 8953 equal to 5001 plus R over n to the n t, okay? So then now what we're gonna do is we're gonna divide both sides by 5,000. Let me see, 8953 divided by 5,000 is 1.7906. One plus point, uh, 0.094 over four is actually equal to 1.0235. So then I'm going to take the LN of both sides. Then I'm gonna bring my power down. And then I'm gonna divide by both the four and the ln of 1.0235 so that I can get the t all by itself, but I gotta do the same thing on this side. And so then I'm gonna type that in the calculator. Um, ln of 1.7906 over four ln of 1.0235, and we get 6.27. It says round to the nearest hundredth, tenths, hundredths. I already did that, so it's 6.27 years.